I am deadly with a pen. Call me Kira if I touch it, it's bomb. Call me Kira, I'm a god eater. Call me killer if my name in it, they gonna call me Villa. And that's facts. You know how to act. I'm so to pulling up in all black. Mr. Guido, cause I gotta stay strapped. Similar to the deal, how I stay coming back. I be on third, nigga chilling with his ramen. Still breathing with the homin. They call me king up to the point that is coming. My killer queen head game, bombing it. Yo, what's up everybody, it's boy Jet here and welcome back to a brand new video and if there's one thing you should know about me, it's that I am a big fan of the 5 room series, hence the gameplay in the background, and the fo not the gameplay, but the footage in the background, there will be gameplay later on, but I love Fire Emblem, my favorite being Blazing Blade and Binding Blade on the Game Boy Advance, those are really really fun and I highly recommend them. I've played a good couple of games in the series so far, including Three Houses. Uh, there, there's Three Houses, there's Bising Blazing Blade, and many others. Hey, hi, post editing Jed here. When I was listing off some of the games that I played, I forgot to mention that I also played the mobile game Fire Emblem Heroes. And I did play that for a good while. I stopped though because I got kind of bored and I could never really get back into it. But there's that as well. Anyways, I'll make it back to the video. I'm gonna waste your time. Goodbye. I love Fire Emblem, if you didn't already know. I adore this series. But one thing that I also love is warrior style games. And Fire Emblem Warriors is a game that I actually thought was really, really cool as a concept. And I'm actually really glad I got to experience a little bit of it that I did. Sadly, I never got to experience the whole game. But I am really, really intrigued by the concept of Fire Emblem as a Warriors game. That whole deal just sort of really strikes a nerve with me that really makes me happy. <laughs> and it just brings a lot of intrigue to me. Which is why, part, mostly why I'm intrigued by the newest Fire Emblem entry, which is also another Fire Emblem Warriors game. And the topic of this video, Fire Emblem Warriors Three Hopes. And the first thing I want to talk about more than anything is how it looks and it looks fucking amazing i just have to say that now <laughs> it genuinely does look really really good and i've never actually been happier to see things look this good because it looks it looks really good it looks really really fun i can't even lie <laughs> we got to see some new designs for some older characters from three houses like hilda mercedes you get the idea they day away hilbert hilbert actually looks really fucking hubert i don't know why the fuck i said hilbert <laughs> hubert actually looks really really fucking sick in my dumbass but he actually looks really cool really fun and so does hilda and i can't i just i genuinely just can't wait but another thing i want to talk about the titular thumbnail character and the main protagonist of the game shiz shiz actually has a really sick design i can't i can't I can't even lie, the design for Shez is so fucking cool, bro. <laughs> like, not, like, no joke, I, this has been a thing with me for a while now. When it comes to the Fire Emblem characters whose designs you can pick, whether they want, to, you want them to be male or female, with the exception of really, Corrin, I tend to like the theme. No, or the exception of Robin, I tend to like the female design more. I like the female design for female for Corn more than I do the male design for Corn and vice versa with Byleth. Although Byleth is all right, I just don't fuck with male Byleth design all too much. But it is an, it is a nice design. It's an all right design. However, Shez, both the male and female versions for Shez actually look really fucking sick. I can't even lie. They actually look fucking amazing. Male Robin's design is amazing. Same with female Robin. And Shez, so far, is the only protagonist to have a design that I really fuck with like that in both the male and female counterparts. Which is really nice to me. Because it's been a while since I've had that. <laughs> uh, yeah. And that's another thing I want to talk about. So, fuck. <laughs> I'm sorry, give me a second. We do this in one take, one take, one take, one take, one take. <laughs> give me a second. But yeah, another reason why I'm so excited for this game um, is because Three Houses as a game it's a fun game. It's a genuinely, really, really, really fun game. 
but it just does it also gets kind of boring i'm gonna be honest like half of the game is boring the other half isn't <laughs> that makes any sense like the, the the part of the gameplay that the series is known for the more tactical action-based gameplay of it all is actually really really fun it's just the part that more or less involves the school and some of the characters tends to be kind of boring because I don't care about a lot of them like that. Especially the blue lines. I don't give a fuck about most of the blue lines. The only ones that I give a fuck about from the blue lines are the girls in Sylvain. And the only reason I care about Sylvain is because he's fucking hilarious. <laughs> like, Sylvain is just the, the fucking goat, bro. Sylvain is so fucking funny. <laughs> Uh, yeah, the game overall is just kind of it's, it's kind of a math factor for me, honestly. It's not a bad game. It's just kind of meh, yeah. Like on its own, I feel like it's fucking great. But I feel like when you compare it to when you consider the fact that Fire Emblem has been a franchise for a very, very, very long time, there have been a multitude of games before it. And if you if you're familiar with a lot of the games of this series before Three Houses, like for me, I had already been big into Fire Emblem before Three Houses, which is kind of just why it's a bit of a math factor for me personally. But I do still really like the game. It's just not as good as say Awakening, Blazing Blade, Binding Blade, fucking Secret Stones. It's, it's alright. Fates is also far better to me, anyways. That's whatever. We're getting off topic. Um, yeah, I am actually really excited for this game. I really hope it does well. All I know is I'm definitely going to be buying this game. I expect a bunch of videos on it when it does come out. Uh, I'm going to stop wasting your time. Goodbye.